Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Court orders release of Hillary's found deleted emails. Remember when it was made known that former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton had used a private unsecured email server to conduct State Department business? The use of a private unsecured server was deemed to be illegal if any of the emails contained sensitive or classified government information. What did Honest Hillary do? She claimed that all 33,000 emails had been suddenly deleted and lost forever. That's the kind of excuse a school kid would give a teacher when the student didn't do their homework assignment. It didn't computer experts long to retrieve Hillary's deleted emails and now it seems that a judge has ruled that the discovered emails will be released to public this September. Big League Politics Hillary Clinton's deleted emails will be released to the public in September 2018, in accordance with a court ruling pertaining to the contents of Clinton's backup email device. It turns out that fired FBI Director James Comey had Hillary Clinton's definitive backup email device the entire election and never searched it. Thanks to the work citizen researcher Larry Kawa, the coverage of big league politics, the determined congressional work of Rep. Ron DeSantis, and the lawyers of Tom Fitton's Judicial Watch, a court ruling from U.S. District Court Judge Randolph Moss orders the State Department to hand over the contents of the backup device by September 2018, right before the midterm elections. Big League Politics exclusively learned that Hillary Clinton's email storage company, Platte River Networks, subcontracted to a company in Connecticut called Datto, which backed up the vast majority of Clinton's deleted emails, text messages and other electronic communications. Datto handed six disks containing information to the FBI in October 2015. One of those disks contains at least a great many of her missing emails. Comey turned the disks over to the State Department, which has been compelled to search them and release the contents. Many, including myself, believe that Hillary still committed a crime with her emails and then committed perjury several times when she lied to Congress, the courts and to the American people. The way Democrats are trying to go after President Donald Trump, they deserve equal treatment meaning that Hillary should be charged for her crimes involving her email scandal and more. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.